Using the TIRM setup, you can also image a glass uh, lens with a known radius of curvature, and the image will look something like this, uh, where there's a dark center and it gets brighter on the outside. So dark means contact, white means not contact. And when you plot the grayscale intensity along this yellow line, you'll get a plot like this, where uh, this, this is the grayscale intensity with respect to the radius, and you'll see that there's a dip and uh, where there is near contact. And you can see that there's actually um, a, a offset between real contact at the very bottom of this bell curve and the contact that I'm measuring. And this is uh, very normal uh, when we come to our measurements. And so we have to offset this entire plot downwards. About, it's, about, it's equivalent to about 100 nanometers. So if we assume that basically all the energy is lost into the third medium, okay, so where you have total, totally frustrated um, internal reflection, the uh, height with respect to uh, radius will look like the red curve. However, in reality, we have reflections at the glass interface, and so this blue line is what is is, is actually more true to um, the curvature. And how do we prove this? Well, we can actually plot um, the uh, the blue line basically using our MATLAB code. Um, and this code basically takes in all you have to do is use the normalized intensity and plug it into this um, code, and you'll get basically the output. The output will basically be the um, the blue lines here, and when you plot uh, this blue curve um, and offset it to so that the minimum point is the um, zero, then you will find that this black dotted line, dashed line actually, is the actual radius of curvature, and the blue is our measured. And so you see that there's a very good correlation between the blue data points and the black dashed line, and so. Uh, whereas if you plotted the red curve with the black dashed line, you will not get a good um, agreement with the theory and the uh, measured value. Okay, and 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 basically the input the MATLAB code takes is this normalized intensity i over i naught, and so you want to uh, make sure though that this normalized intensity is not greater than. Uh, um, one or else the code will not work and so sometimes you have to get it down to even 0.98 or 97 um, as the maximal intensity okay and we normalize the intensity by basically um, the intensity of this line that we drew when there is uh, basically no uh, change no, uh, basically no lens okay so um, the initial state okay